Hello, YouTubers. Um, I wanted to come on here real quick and tell you guys that don't go to Verizon. Definitely do not go to Verizon. Um, okay, so um, we went and got two blackberries, as you know. Um, my mom doesn't like hers. I sold hers on eBay. And um, blah, 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 whatever. Um, but she started having some problems with some harassing phone calls uh, last month. And it was uh, just some freeloaded uh, drunk who wouldn't stop drunk dialing, basically. Anyway, I called up Verizon and told him, you know, um, can we get the number changed? And I'm like, sure, you know, no problem. Free of charge. Only not. Um, we got our bill yesterday, and it was showing $640. And this was not a paper bill. This is online because I did everything online, of course. Um, $640. And I'm just like, oh, my gosh. So, um... I waited till today for the actual bill to process and come up online, and the bill is not $640. So the bill is actually $784. And I'm just like, what? <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> so I look at the explanation as to why the bill is so high, and they charged her an early termination fee. Um, and then, of course, they credit it back but it shows up on the first bill so next month that'll go back on the bill it was a credit but it don't show up till the next bill and if you don't pay this bill this month then they're going to disconnect you you can't wait till next month for that to show back up it just won't happen they charged us that they also charged me a hundred dollar overage on my data with tethering um, that I haven't even been using and that's supposed to be like a five gig cap and whatever um, they charged me an activation fee for the little data card that I went and got uh, here when I didn't have cable, which, of course, will be credited back next month. They also charged me an early termination fee on that, which, of course, will be credited back next month. This month, $784. Next month, um, the bill would come down to about just under $500, which is still extremely too much. Um, so I wanted to see what else it is they charged us for, and because my mom had changed her number in the middle of the month, they prorated half of our minutes. And so we went over, and they charged us an overage in minutes, about $100 worth. <laughs> this is crazy. It's just, out, it's just absolutely crazy. Um, we have already contacted AT&T, uh, have a plan built and set up. I get an iPhone 3GS 16 gig. Um, I'm trying to get my mom to get the 8 gig. She doesn't really want it, so we're going to go look at them. Um, I'm waiting on my new debit card, and just as soon as that debit card comes in, we are going to Asheville, if you guys know where that's at, uh, to the local AT&T store. And um, here I come, iPhone. Um, as for the BlackBerry, I am going to go ahead and early terminate this uh, and just have them bill me the early termination fee. There's no way I'm going to be able to pay any of that bill anytime soon, but as long as I terminate this early... Um, it won't be tied down to my account. This is already on eBay. If you guys want it, the link in the sidebar over here. Yes, over here. And, um, I, you know, go bid on it. I'm, I'm hoping to get about $200 out of it. Um, the reserve is at $190, but that's for you guys only. My YouTube subscribers get to know that the reserve is at $190. Don't bid up the reserve and then just stop. I had a guy last night um, bid on some stuff that I had, and he bid... Uh, past the reserve and then wouldn't pay and that's a, that was a big story that's a long story and that's not worth talking about um, one of my subscribers he had good intentions he really did but um, but just don't do it <laughs> it's not going to help me don't don't intend to help me because that really doesn't help at all um, but regardless link in the sidebar um, if you guys are interested I have uh, the BlackBerry on eBay. It ends in about two days, a few hours, and um, I'm going to get an iPhone. See you guys later.